Good morning, guys. I'm Mary Beth on the Mary and Joe channel. Today, I'm going to rearrange a little small bathroom by putting a new cabinet on the wall. Uh huh. Y'all know who that is. Joe Clive watching people feed the fish at the park at the gazebo. This is the small bathroom that I am going to put a new cabinet in. I am going to leave these um, towels. If you follow me on my videos, about three weeks ago, I did a video of how to arrange towels on towel rings and towel racks. So this set, I did at that time, arranged it with this little tassel. So, I'm going to just keep it right in this place. Let me get over here so I can show you. And the main thing I'm going to be doing in here is uh, removing this shelf. And exchanging it with another one because it's got kind of rickety. And as far as this shower curtain, I'm leaving it in place. And I have already changed the shower lining in here. So it's ready to go. We're actually working on the last parts of this renovation. And it's putting in this shelf. So everything matches in here. I got this another little uh, flower from Home Goods, and I've put it there and everything uh, is pretty much matching with this little coconut tree I did these a few weeks ago so the last thing we're gonna do is change this shelf see what we can do with it as you can see I've removed everything from this shelf from the, from the top to the bottom I'm going to go ahead and remove it from the bathroom. And I'll be right back. So I have successfully removed that shelf and the laundry basket. And the wall looks pretty good behind it. It's just an empty space now. So we're going to add another cabinet. I'm going to add the one. If you saw my video from my first bathroom makeover, I took a shelf down from that bathroom and added a, a bookcase. So I'm going to use that shelf in here. It's more stable than the one I had in here. So let's get started. Okay, guys, I got the new shelf up. I had to use some little screws and I'll cover them over. But that's how the shelf looks. All right, now I'm going to move my other little shelf here, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, this is one hour later. I've got a flower up on my shelf, basket, I've got the towel rack decorated, and I've got my other little shelf in here. So this is the way this space is going to look. If I can get it to you from another angle. Okay. I think I like it. And I took this little flower Moved over here in this space. And now, that sends me on another little shopping spree. Get my glasses. I need something to go on, another basket to go on the back of the commode. And I'm going to Houston this weekend. I will purchase that. 
and it will be all done in this bathroom. I've decided to make one more little change. I needed something in that little space and I just found some bath salt and stuck it in there. I moved the little flower from over in this corner and I had this elephant and this uh, vanilla vanilla candle from Kirkland's that I'll just sit there temporarily till I go shopping again and I set the flower back over here. So now we can say that we're done. So guys, when I was cleaning this mirror, I noticed that it's got some bounce in it. It looks like it uh, wants to come down. So what I've done is I got my hot glue gun and until I can get a professional person to come and fix uh, this mirror, I am going to hot glue it to the wall. I can't have it fall. So, I'm going to plug in my hot glue gun and do that. It'll take 10 minutes or so for that hot glue gun to get going. So, I'll be back. Okay, guys, I just put the hot glue on. I even glued this little thing right here on. Okay. I don't think it'll move anymore. Not for a while. Okay, so we can put the hot glue gun up. That's my little crafty mini high temperature gun. And it uses uh, these little glue sticks from Dollar Tree. And they are Crafter Square glue sticks. So they're nifty to uh, try to fix something that's minor. So guys, it took me a while and I look a little frazzled, but I'm finished with this bathroom, number two, and I need you to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!